Unboxing video time. So you can see we had the label on here. Can't necessarily tell what's in here, but Asus Prime H610M ED4. Okay, let's check out what's in the box. All right, folks, so we got SATA cables, user guide, M.2 standoff, driver disc, I.O. shield, all right? Now, we also have, of course, the motherboard. Let's talk about that in more detail. Starting at the top, 1x8 CPU power connector. Here's your CPU headers for the CPU, excuse me, the headers for the CPU fans. DDR4, two RAM slots there, 24 pin connector for the power supply, USB 3.0 there. Uh, there is one other fan header. That's about all I found on the sink, folks. So that's for the case. Here are your case connectors. You've got uh, power supply, HDD reset, and uh, power LED, four SATAs, two USB 2.0s. Somewhere in here is one of the RGBs. Uh, HD audio, COM, PCIe, this is the 1.01, PCIe 4.0 times 16, two M.2s Gen 4, CMOS, battery there, LGA 1700, possibly LGA 1800 compatible. PS2 style connectors, I think this is VGA, HDMI, display port, USB 3.0, 2.0, LAN, this is a 1 gig, line out, headphone, microphone. And that's it, folks. Thanks for checking out the video. Hope you got something out of it. We'll do some uh, additional flyovers. I guess I missed anything. This is a very bare bones motherboard, folks. You're not getting a whole lot out of it. This is your, uh, like, basically your cheapest way into 12th gen, right? You want one of these guys. I wouldn't put this in there, but consider these two for this. And that's about it. Uh, this is going to have limitations that some of the better motherboards will not have. Um, but if you need 12th gen, this is super cheap, folks. Hey, thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe.